Hey everybody, it's Dr. Paul here. We're gonna run through how to take some pictures for a virtual appointment since it's looking like it might be a little while before we can see you back in the office. And so one of the things you'll wanna do first is make sure you wash your hands. Uh, with everything going around right now, make sure that your hands are really clean. Uh, get a couple of spoons that are clean. You're gonna use those to hold your cheeks away from your teeth and have a friend to take pictures for you or a parent. Um, and if you're wearing rubber bands, if you're in braces, make sure you hook your rubber bands up. If you are wearing aligners or a retainer, make sure you take all these pictures with your aligners in or with your retainer in, because uh, we want to see how they're fitting. So we're going to get started. Candace has agreed to model for us, and um, she has a couple of spoons ready. The first thing she's going to do is slip those into her teeth or into her lips to retract them away. Pull them down just a little bit so we can see all the teeth. Perfect. And we're going to get as close as we can and from as straight on as we can. I have my flash on. And we'll take it. Good. And then she's going to remove the left spoon and keep the right one in and kind of pull back real tight on that. And again, we're getting as perpendicular as we can. Get my finger out of the way. And good. We can see the bite. And on this side, same thing. We can see as many of the teeth as we can. We can see the bite. She's biting all the way down on her back teeth. And it is in focus. It's in focus. Good. And then the last thing she's going to do, uh, no more retractors or, or spoons. She's going to hook her upper lip with her fingers, open really wide, tip her chin back. We're gonna get as perpendicular as we can to those teeth so we can see the biting edges of the teeth. Good, and take it. And then she's gonna do the same thing on the lower. She's gonna tip her chin down, open really wide, and hook her lower lip with her fingers. Perfect, so we can see those biting edges. Good. So the next step is gonna to be to fill out the form and submit the photos. So on the same device, that you have taken the pictures, navigate to a web browser, go to the link that we've sent you, fill out the patient's name, today's date, answer any questions that are gonna vary based on the type of appointment that we're doing or the clients that we're checking in on. Be honest when you answer the questions about how much you're wearing your rubber bands or your aligners or your retainer. Then we're gonna upload the photos. So tap choose files and then tap photo library. This is done on an iPhone. Then we're gonna to navigate to the photos that we have taken, select each one of them by tapping on it, and then we're gonna tap done in the right-hand corner, top right-hand corner. The next step is very important. You have to tap on the upload form attachments button. If you don't do this, the photos will not be attached when you submit your form. So after you tap upload form attachment, the form's gonna take a few minutes to actually upload those attachments and once it has completed that, you will see the form reload just like that. And the attachments will be listed there individually, the photos with an X mark next to them. And now you can sign the form and click on submit and you're finished. Thank you. And we will be in touch.